Yo, what's up guys? I'm here with the uh, fly cap. Uh, I've just finished my assembly build with this. It's probably taking me all in all an hour to put this whole thing together. It just took a little, little bit longer because of the box glue. I tried using um, super glue, uh, the little top, like this stuff. And um, I used it on these parts and it actually melted the foam. So I wouldn't suggest using any cheap super glue, maybe specific stuff, but I used epoxy glue, maybe a bit heavier to use, but I want it to be nice and solid since this is going to be a fast plane. And this video is basically about some of the modifications I've done from doing a little research on the internet reading the forums. Basically, um, what it said, these two tail struts here, they're quite weak and easy to break so uh, I took the advice to put slipping some carbon fiber down them each side, glue a bit of hot glue gun down the sides and on the bottom. So it has quite a bit more strength now, it doesn't wiggle about, it's quite solid. And also I'm not sure, the front piece is apparently a bit weak as well, which I don't know. But um, I basically took a carbon rod and it goes through this piece here like right through. I just shoved it through, put a bit of hot glue going in there, shoved that on through. And then I put some glue on the bottom, stuck it down, and then it goes all the way to like the end of the tip. And also, um, one thing about these planes that I also read on the forums is that they don't actually meet up quite well with the parts. So like here I had like a big gap so I filled it in with glue so it didn't cause any problems with the airflow. And I added a little bit of a covering scheme on the bottom so I can tell the bottom from the top. Uh, the stickers are pretty good, they stick down very well, very easy to put on. The only thing I've changed with the stickers is I've added my own sticker here, or tiger, and I made that one from here to there, so it looks it looks better, I think. But um, hopefully, I shall be able to give us a fly soon. I'm just waiting on my next order to get a other receiver for this plane. And once I've got that, I shall update you guys with a flight video. And I hope to put quite a few out there because there aren't so many of videos of this plane with a push uh, prop setup. It's mainly EDFs. But um, I'm running a 3550. KV motor here, Tenergy 2218, and um, it's rated at like 500 watts. So once we've got it all hooked up and everything, we'll do a uh, test on this watt meter, and we'll see how much power we're pop popping out of this little baby. But uh, till then, guys, uh, this is just an update video on my uh, flycat. Hope you guys enjoyed and subscribe.